Michael was an example of someone who experienced both homelessness and a brain injury. He died before receiving the specialist support he needed. Following his death, the professionals involved in his care came together to remember his life and explore what could be learned to prevent this from happening to others. It was like an atomic bomb had hit Liverpool, but there was no consequences at that time. So what happens is that there was a drug introduced to the streets and people just started to use that drug. But they didn't know the role that they were going to take, they didn't know the consequences that were going to come with that until years later. I work for Brain Injury Services and I think <clears throat> really um, Michael is a prime example of somebody who should have had brain injury in quite a long time. Thank you.